Okay, good morning. We enjoyed a really, really nice party in Genji's new house last night. I think we had a bit too much alcohol. Everybody's getting ready. We're hitting a big ride today around Biwako, Japan's biggest lake. That's Nagoya Station. Seven fifty AM, Biwa Cole parking lot, Lake Biwa. It's bloody freezing. Haven't felt this cold in a long time, to be honest. I feel underdressed. Samui this ne. different levels but the pace isn't bad so far. Really really nice but I don't know how I feel about the Biwa Core, the Lake Biwa ride so far. There's a lot of traffic, there's a lot of tunnels, a lot of fast moving vehicles, a lot of wind too which kind of makes it harder obvious reasons. Obviously, when you're on a bike ride, you've got to consider the gram. And when you come through a, a road that's covered by trees in such a beautiful canopy style, you've got to think of the gram. So, we're running in the road one by one to get some nice shots for the gram. <laughs> oh, it's super rocky, man. <laughs> Kenji's doing it on a brakeless fixed gear. Mad guy. So this is Lake B was famous Miami Beach. Welcome to Miami. What you gonna do when it is? Anyway, this is where Kansai Cyclocross has a couple of races through the next season. It looks like a wicked place to come, it's just really far from Nagoya. Kansai is the kind of region below Chubu, which is Chubu is central Japan where Nagoya sits. And Kansai is the region below with Osaka and Kyoto, so it's a bit far unless you've got some transport to get to the race, like you're not going to ride there. And even getting the trains here is a bit tricky to if you really need a car. Oh, it's tough now, tough for everybody. 120 kilometers. 125. We found this fresh fruit and vegetable store. We got some dried mango, some freshly baked discount goods. It's getting tough. So this is Voko coffee. If you're ever cycling around Biwako, 
don't come to this coffee shop, no cyclists allowed. So when you're in Biwa, you need to look out for this flag. Biwaichi Cycle Station. Cycle racks, toilets, pumps, tools, seats. If it hasn't got a bike stand or this blue flag, basically you know they're going to be a bit unfriendly. As we found out and as we're still upset from. Combini yes. coffee. Black Thunder top recommended mini chocolate bar in Japan. This thing is amazing. Look at that sky. And that's it, 155 kilometers. We cycled the last stretch in the dark with no lights on the cycling road. With the wind bashing against us and the waves from the big lake bashing against the seawall at the side of us. But it was fun because it's been a fairly samey samey ride all day long and kind of added a bit of an edge to it. off with some ramen. I've been Bradley OG. Thanks for watching First Over Everything. Please subscribe to everybody's Instagram. And subscribe to the First Over Everything Instagram at First Over Everything. Instagram? What? Instagram. Yeah. Ah. Look what I'm done by. Shout your name at Instagram. Uh, check me out at, at uh, Kenji Muto. Instagram. For my Instagram, real that dude Alki. Rio the dude out okay. yeah. here.